This is Dungeon Man's. Uh, it's been around for quite a while. It came out in 2014 originally, um, and I think it's been made by just one guy. I think. Um, it's a traditional turn-based roguelike, you know, um, uh, old-timey style. But it uh, it, um, it it does not take itself too seriously. I think is is the way to describe it. Um, our job is to grow the Dungeon Man's Academy, so we're going to go out, fight, find some loot, uh, build the academy up, and, and just be a hero, basically. Uh, this game is continuously being updated. It's been updated a lot. Um, and it's just got an update out just like a month ago. I think less than a month ago? Just a month ago? Somewhere in there. It got a an update recently, which has added in um, pets. So now we can pick up some pets along the way and, and uh, serve our... So, uh, I, I play this... It's been, I guess, a little over a year ago, and uh, when I I did a, um, I don't remember where this was placed. I did a like a, um, a March Madness thing of roguelikes last last year, I think. And I had this one on it. Am I, th am I thinking right? I this one on it. I, th I think it did pretty well, but I don't I, clearly I don't remember. Anyway, let's play this game. Uh, no, no, let's go and uh, play a new game, New Academy. All right, uh, I found a new academy. The story begins in the Forgotten Age, a legend lost in histories that were buried in old myth. On the familiar, unfamiliar shores of an untamed land, a hero strode forth to... Uh, don't be silly, that hero is not you. Strode forth to bring the light of knowledge and civilization to a wild continent known only as... Uh, Sir might be already be in there. As a nook. Okay. The great hero upon the shores of nook brought with him one thing. Wait, did I just name my... Whoops. Shores of Nook. <laughs> uh, I'm set out to build a mighty Dungeon Man's Academy. That's my that's my job. Uh, institution of higher learning and martial training. One that would serve as a beacon of civilization. That's me. So begins the story of one young ca uh, candidate, ready to embark on the rigorous years of study required to be a true Dungeon Man's. I named the continent Nook. I meant to do that. What's the candidate's name? Uh, Bob Ross. That's me. I got him a little backwards. Okay, so, you know, random rolls, that kind of thing. If you don't like it, you re-roll it. Uh, but, um, you know, and all that. But we'll, we'll keep it as is. We got strength, skills, science, and foom. Foom is magic. Science is reduced magic damage taken. Skills increases accuracy. The dex, basically, and strength is strength. Um, I think maybe we go in and bash things. Yeah, like that, like that one there. Uh, what kind of, what kind of hero do we want to be? We can be a ranger man, a fighter man, a wizard man. A necromancer, a psychomancer, a southern gentleman, a tourist man. Um, pole arms have range of two tiles. Use a range attack to hit a distance if you're attacking in melee. They automatically hit secondary enemies. By Banners make a big difference, but they take up your whole action. Use them at the right time. Um, we got zones of control. Then skewer your enemies upon far-reaching pole arms. I mean, I'm always up for a necromancer, but I think the last dignity and decorum are your way of life. You endure the sticks and stones of the lowborn through the mask of politeness that hides your ever-growing rage. Up to you to decide when you've had enough. A woe be tied anything within shouting distance when you do. When I've lost my temper, ire burns down in real time, quick attacks, and get as much killing done as you can. Decorum powers don't cause you to lose your temper. Yeah, you know what? We'll be a southern gentleman. Uh, Bob Ross, Southern Gentleman. Uh, I'm gonna Southern Born. Base health is increased by 5% and you are 100% resistant to stuns. Can't read books. They're too tasty. Words mean nothing to you. Only action. Hey, Dr. Vamps. Um, take less fire damage. Deal more damage. Uh, a world champion. More champion monsters spawn in the world. Mad thirsty. First potion you drink in a round does not cost you an action. Using stamina base towers create a strain for two rounds instead of five. I'm gonna go with uh, a Southern Born and um, overflowing with natural enzymes. 20% AP gain, generally one action every five rounds. Take 15% more damage from everything. Well, under 20% of your maximum health, you deal 20% more damage. Yeah, yeah, defiant. Where's Bob at? Where's Bob? There's Bob right there. That's Bob. He 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 let the perm go, and that's Bob. All right. To adventure.
on the land, the mysterious land of Nook. <laughs> so graduated Bob Ross, newly minted Southern Gentleman of the Dungeon Man's Academy. Congrats, Bob Ross. As first graduate of the Dungeon Man's Academy, there is much that rests upon your shoulders. Uh, no, I'm ready for adventure, Headmaster. He's going to give us tutorial things or whatever. But we've got, I think I remember what's going on here. We've got this guy. Go out there and find some dungeons. Uh, we've got a uh, an artifact, an academy war chest. Upgrade the academy by returning artifacts there. So the main goal here, this is my academy. Uh, we've got like the, well, we go talk to him. We've got the librarian over here. Um, oh, you sure in the right, you're in the right place? Uh, as you can see, this library is, is in deplorable condition. It's barren as my miserable wife's dusty womb. <laughs> it's a rattling head. We're an embarrassment to the written word, so get out, go adventure, and if somehow you manage to come back on your own two feet, maybe you can be so kind as to give books you don't want to the headmaster, he says. So bring books back to him. Got it. Got it. Got it. <laughs> and then we have the, we have the, um, the grand chemistress. Uh, not that there's much to drink, this is a miserable excuse for Alchemy Lab! I'll keep an eye out for some, uh, some things for you. Get out of the way. And then we have the blacksmith over here who can go and give me some gear and all that. Um, also out in the world, um, we'll see the world in a minute. We can go like upgrade towns and all that, but let's just go run over here and just head out in the world, you know, and say hello. Hello there, young Bob Ross. How you doing? Oh, me? Well, I'm just in this empty graveyard here, nice and empty. I'm gonna stay that way too, right? It would be best if it didn't have to do no digging. Uh, so if you die, your grave will be there, and then you, you keep the same academy and keep coming back. Might as well take a vacation now, because I'm going to one-shot this whole continent. You watch. I say. Okay. And we've got uh, some, some kids over here training. All right. You mewling zero-level scrublets, pay attention. Here's Bob Ross, a real hero. And what real hero Bob Ross is going to do for us is head out into the world and defeat champions. Those monsters with the glowing red aura. You crush them like there's no tomorrow and bring back the proofs of strength. That they drop. Bring them back, and you'll be making yourself stronger and bolstering every future Academy graduate. Isn't that right, Bob Ross? Mark this day, recruits. For real hero Bob Ross, that's often the name of war and victory. He shall return atop a dragon of thunder, clutching a thousand skulls. That's right. Okay. Okay, enough of that. Two adventures. All right, so it's randomly generated. We're in the main world, but we've got a couple things around that we'll check out. I, th I think I'm, I'm here, right? Um, and we'll go venture out in the world and, and save the day and all that. So let's do that. Um, we got looks like a, a spooky cave over here. Uh, is there an option for my keys? I think we'll just have to figure it out. I think, our, uh, you know, it's a roguelike. I should be able to figure them out. I have some actions over here we can do. Um, I can swing my two axe, my two-handed axe. I've got rapier wit. Enter a parrying stance that will counterattack foes and melee and apply a powerful bleeding effect. Hmm. Also, I have quick dash. Requires medium armor. Uh, if I remember correctly, um, I'm using yesterday's knife and a thick plank with a bent nail. Mm -hmm. um, in my... Is it this one? Nope, nope. Uh, character sheet? There we go. Um, so, I... There's all my stats there. Masteries, right? That's it. Okay, so I am a a um, southern gentleman, which is which is which is uh, this one. Um, I can I can rank up in any stat, so I can still go into necromancer if I wanted to. Um, I just sort of get a head start in southern gentleman, and there's my rapier wit one. And as I get skills, you know, we can put in other stuff. <laughs> um, we've also got uh, how do I get back? How do I get in that menu? Uh, P? No, C? C. Uh, skills and powers, which we can do, uh, you know, uh, those assigned to a hotkey. I do want to do that. Uh, yeah, it's already there. Okay. Uh, and then... Pay to lose is, like, support the dev. Um, and that's it. We have the map. Map. Okay. Okay. Let's go, um, let's go to, we can go to town here real quick and check it out. So the way the town works is, let's go talk with the guy with the hat over here. Hello, Bob Ross, I'm the town mayor, what can I do for you? Uh, uh how's this town's prosperity? So, right now prosperity is zero out of one, uh, we're out of danger here. Um, 
if I find any purloined inventory, be sure to bring it and help us grow. So as I give them things, the town grows, I get better gear, you know, that kind of that kind of thing. It's uh, That's the mechanic of, of that. Uh, I think the, the, like, the smith can do better things for me. Um, what are the effects of high prosperity? Merchants have more, more and better things. Um, lower prices for me. And you can find during your travels. Every town has a maximum prosperity. And they'll be more dangerous and distant to the town, the higher the maximum will be. Makes sense. Okay, got it. So we have, you know, folks around here. I guess he's just shopping. Like this guy over here. What you got for sale? He's got some junk. Uh, some scrolls and, uh, and and some things. Mana potion, antidote potion. Man, we don't need none of that. We can go fight. Uh, does prosperity stay between runs? I don't know. Actually, let's get out of here though. This happy music's making Bob Ross sick. Um, so we got a camp down there. Let's go, uh, visit... Let's go just a little, little, little round. You know, just check out a couple things. There's another town over there. Get this fog away. Camp over there. Let's just go to this, uh, this, this little newbie dungeon here. The Scrollball war Warren. Foolish red creature setting up their squalid home not far... Not a stone's throw from the Dungeon Man's Academy. It's as if they weren't to be crushed. Okay. I'm gonna go pick some stuff up and crush things. And I think I'm just gonna go and smash things. Where's my health bar? Probably need to keep an eye on that. Uh, there it is. Okay, bottom, bottom. Is my face in the way? No, it's not. Smack them little scroll balls, uh, scroll balls around. There you go. I'll take all your stuff, and I'm gonna put on. I think is that good? Uh, put that on. Don't know how to use it. Matt. Put my gladiator skirt on, though. There we go. Um, and then, uh, a bendy iron heater. Sure. Don't know how to use that. Alright. What are blandles? Alright. Uh, okay. Go pick up some cash. Break some barrels. Do I heal up if I rest? Oops. Ouch. Uh, I got a scroll. I don't know what the scroll is until I until I use it. So we're gonna use it. Uh, I feel the the curse eating magic course through his inventory and equipped items, but there were no curses to eat. It's a scroll of eat curse. Okay. Um, let me, let me, where's my control? Where's my controls? I don't know. Well, um, I have to pull him up here. Take that, buddy. I'll take your bow. Ooh, body parts went flying. It's got to be like a um, just rest. Okay, just resting. Just five does it. Okay. A guide to mon to mastering dungeons. Well, that's something I should be reading. Consume this book and and gain one point of advanced delving. Sure, sure. I'll take that. A psycho focus. Uh, enchantments on this item will not function. What does it do? A talisman that serves a gateway for energy from outside the world, outside the world to join with psycho mancer's internal focus. Can I use this? Yeah, I'll wear it. Sure. Take that. Pick up some cash here. Break a few things. Pick up a, a congealed tangerine potion. We don't know what it does. We'll wait until we get in a real bad spot, then we'll drink it. That's a healing potion if I ever saw one. Ochreous drought. Drought. Give me your shield, and um, let's go this way. Oh, oh, what you got there? A prance elf limp caster. I ain't no caster. Hooray! All right. 
Let's level up. Uh, we got to go in Masteries, correct? One point. Okay, so we can go into either Fire and Brimstone. Few are they who command the art of cruel, wounding language like a southern gentleman's foom-based damage. Poisonous ice burns and unspeakable curses shouted in random directions. <laughs> We've got Sound and Fury. Oh, <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah. That's an, <laughs> ask any questions. Sometimes it's best answer, but just to <laughs> bind these strength-based powers, keys to start, start mashing. Oh, yeah. I mean, we gotta go with it. We gotta go with it. Uh, can I put it like there. I should use these these abilities here. Okay, let's try it. Um, so one does the like the, the attack back. No, not one, not that one. That's that was press the attack. Take one step forward and swing wide in front of you. This is the rapier wit one, which is like a counter attack thing, and then we've got the quick dash. And then, and then that one. Okay, um, let's quick dash. Okay, uh, can we do that one? No. So if I wait around, I can do that one. There we go. It's a faint looking scroll you got there, buddy. I'm gonna read that. Okay, let's just loot all this stuff here. And, um,. Oh yeah, it's got a it's got a, a very uh, very Adam Adam feel for sure. Uh, anything good here we got? So I can use this this uh, limb caster, but I'm not much of a spell casting kind of guy. I got a couple scrolls. We don't know what those things do. I do have a combat tunic, which is which it says I can't use. Tear the sleeves off if it makes you feel strong. <laughs> Okay, all right. Um, so using this board, I'd like to have a weapon. Let's go downstairs. Ouch. What was that? Uh, though you may crush easily these chittering weaklings, do not underestimate, underestimate their champions. All right. Um. Ouch. Ouch. Knock it off! Take some new pants. Are those any good pants? Gladiator skirt. It is a good pants. Those are plus one. We don't know what that one is. It's a mystery. Um. I don't know what. I guess we can use a scroll and see what it does. Carefully escape dungeon. Surrounded by safe. Okay. So these, this is like old time rogue. We don't know what it is until we use one, then we'll learn what it is. Bees, please? Okay, we won't use that one. <laughs> We're gonna throw bees on people. Uh, what's this one? Blink. Okay, hello. And then we've got this one. Cold monster. Okay. Ooh, ooh that, that's good stuff. That's good stuff. Uh, can I wear it? I can't. Real armor. Can't use real armor. I can only use metal or medium armor. Pin to win. Okay. We've got potions we can drink too. I'm going to hold off on that. What about that, that door spike? Is that any good? No, it's just. Okay. Uh, why did I leave? Oh, I walked right into that, didn't I? Whoops. Whoops. Okay. That guy's looking kind of scary. Uh, can I charge up on that guy? Let's go. Wink. Just see what it does. There we go. And then I'm going to, um... Rape here with this guy, and then, and then smash him. I can't. Oh, nice. I'd appreciate it if you'd stop killing me. Scroll the bees, please. <laughs> what is that? Proof of strength. Oh, yeah, I'm a hero. 
Uh, let's just wait around here for a little bit. Get a little healed up. Catch. You knock it off! I want to fight more of you. I'm trying to heal up. Can't take that. I may have ventured down here a little too quick. Um, so I go back to a, uh, the Academy Headmaster, and he'll know what to do with this thing. I guess I can go back there right now, but I think it's, I think I want to hang out here for a minute. When did that Kingdoms and Castles update come out? Did it just, did it just come out? I forgot I had a bow, don't I? Okay, one of these guys coming at me. Can I shoot from there? Oh yeah, we should be doing that. Waiting with wasting my time with this sword all this time. Be no healing on my watch. Okay. Feel feeling mostly better. There we go. Um, let's go to Masteries. Let's get a... Um, so again, we can go wherever we want. We can also go into Adventure Mode and get like... Be able to be, be able to use shields or professional marksmen. Three rounds of not firing a ranged weapon. You're gaining Ranger's Focus. Dual wielding. Um, this is just using not to use shields. I kind of want to look at... What's this give me? Grant Dead Pulse use... Enemies you slay will leave behind dead pulses, tiny sparks of concentrated darkness, deadness, because they're dead. Your training allows you to pick them up, carry them around, and use them to power your spooky necromancy. Gross. I can blow them up. And the next step is, uh, is, is skellies. Raise dead guys. What's this one do? Enhance my rapier wit, which I'm not using. Grab someone next to you and toss them. Uh, <laughs> <D -L. laughs> Uh, yeah. That sounds good. Like a plan. Okay. Um, and was there anything else? We're good here? Okay. Uh, I guess I'd put that in my inventory. In my, or my, in my, uh, this here. Let's use this thing a little more often. I thought those coins there was a was a was a coin. Okay, is there like a F and then yeah. Ooh, scary guys. So you can't like um I thought there isn't just fire cl fire at closest enemy uh key. I don't know it. Some blandles. Pathos, Pathos is a good one, uh, a good phone one. Okay, we're gonna grab this guy. Oh yeah, get out of here! And then we're gonna go and uh, shoot him. Can I use Wazdy? No. All right. Um, let's do, uh, some of that. Of course, some ire. I'm a, I'm a, don't have any ire. Ire is what I have, only five of that. Let's do this one, then. Okay. Okay. Anything good here? So the gladiator skirt, which I don't know what it is. I have magic ones, magic ones of these also, which are gonna be better when I got no matter what. So we'll put those on, and uh, I can really use a weapon. I got a short bow. I got yesterday's knife, which is no good. Mm. All right. All right.
Let's go grab some gold and head on, head on down. How many levels are out of this thing? But look at that guy. Ouch. Anyone else want to die? Can I can I wear that? Is that something I can I can put on? Uh, I do have a gladiator skirt. What's this? This is this is plus one. This is something we know that. This one I can wear. It's good. I don't know what it is, but maybe we'll find an identify scroll somewhere along the way. I guess I could try to use this to enchant. I'd like to enchant my uh can I enchant something I already have my my shoes. Did it work? Cool antiseptic blandles, plus one. 15 poison resist, 12, 20 cold resist. Okay. Uh, what else do I have? That's the only scroll I've got. Okay, we'll just break things, take some spikes, and, uh,. I'm not sure how many levels we have here. We're at, we're at B3F. Whatever that means. There's a scroll over there. Maybe it's an identify. What is it? Bees! Okay. I don't like that one. Anyone else out here? I'm gonna throw this guy. And then I'm gonna uh, punch him. No. I'm gonna. That one. What kind of bow we got there? Discount short bow. Level up here a little bit. There we go. Let's go, uh... Downstairs here, we can find it. Me crush you like egg! Like already broken egg, and me break again! Two break, says... Pludrug Cold Rain. I'm about to two break your stupid scrobal face. Where is he? Oh, he's over there. I don't want to see him already. I got other, other things to deal with. I got other things to deal with. I don't want to deal... Ooh. We're in historical artifact. Uh, I'm gonna turn on my rap rapier wit. Ooh, it's gonna be bad. Uh, can I throw him around? Get out of here. Okay. Um. Don't, don't do that. That's not nice. Um, ten ire. I've only got seven. Ten ire. How do I get ire? Just by killing things? Bees, of course, bees! Where are my bees at? Take that, buddy. Oh! Okay, we're running away. Unless I got some iron. I do have some iron. I can throw a fit, grab someone next to you and toss them. Or every that's like every day something you're gonna throw them away. Get out of here. Okay. Um I would like. Throw out a scroll. What to do? Uh, I'm shielded against lesser projectiles. Hey, that's good. Okay, okay. Um, shoot him. Ouch. I only have nine hit points. I don't have any heals. Pin to win. Pins a monster in place for two rounds. Tangerine potion. What does it do? We don't know. Can I throw him away again? I can't. 
dash away. <laughs> Run away. Um, uh, I gotta find a potion or something. Um, I can pit him, but he's gonna hit me. I can drink a potion and hope for the best. I can just try to run away. There's whatever that thing is, too. Like that, that, what is that? Fragrant distillation. Oh, you don't, don't hit me again. Uh oh, I'm gonna die. Okay, I'm gonna drink a potion. Uh, this one. And I died. If it had just been just him, I would have been just fine. So ends the journey of Bob Ross, level 3 gen southern gentleman, on floor 3 of the convenient scrollbold war. It doesn't sound so good when you put it that way. Defeated by uh, Mr. Cold Rain, who now claims the throne of this leaderless dungeon, uniting the forces of evil with a tremendous show of dungeon man-slaying power. Oh, that's kind of embarrassing. That guy. You know what, if... if, uh, if mm. We'll be alright. Who, who's, who's next? Who's next? Um... Uh, um... Um, Untinti is next. Untinti. Ooh, even stronger. Oh, there's an 18 science. Increase the effect of the duration of potions. Uh, it's a, se and a 17 foom. Increase mana. Damage, ma magic damage. Oh, there we go, yeah. Untinti's gonna be a magic, a magic man. So Psychomancer does what? Bare fists and focus mind are the tools of the Psychomancer. A master of mentalism and martial arts. Flying kicks and things. Could be a necromancer. Throw that out, bad dudes. Um, yeah, well, let's be a necromancer. And, um, I think overflowing with natural enzymes, stamina recovery kicks faster, all mana gains are increased by 20%. That seems like good. Um, I mean, bleeding damage. <laughs> Grew up a poster child for countless f uh, fundraisers, affected by this cruel condition where only one of your perks actually does anything. It hasn't been an easy life, but it'll likely be a short one. <laughs> um, find more coin and loot and breakable items. I don't want more damage from things. Let's be resistant to things. Yeah, and we're going to look like... Um, like that old guy. Yeah. Yeah, we'll be that guy. Okay. To adventure. Let's try this again. Alright, so same thing. I think we're in the same world, so I, I believe I'm... You know... What's-his-face is still here. You're the next bold graduate from this great Dungeon Man's Academy. Your teaching can now complete. There's always a wall of text, should you need a refresher. Avenge those who have fallen before you. Stride to the land and tame the darkness. Uh, where's the wall of text? I think it's... There it is. There's the, there's the wall of text. Scratching the actual knowledge in the wall, you find this. Always check clocks for elixirs. Okay. Champion monsters with their fierce red glow are tougher and stronger than regular versions. Yeah, we know that. Alright. Uh, let's go back out here. Oh, 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 there I am. There he is. Brave Ball Bross. Slain the third floor. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, young Runtinti. Well, it's done. There's the first grave I done dug here, and that's that. Rest in peace, you dungeon mans. I'm sure you did good, probably, but you, Runtinti, you go do better. Keep on living so I don't have to keep digging. Okay. To the overworld. Alright. Um. We can do this. Oh, there's still, like, a ghost of me there. I got this now. I got it. So now I can do things like... Uh, dead, dead pulse. I'll pick these things up as I kill things. Raise uh, a monster, a bolt of foom, and a light shield. Oh, look. Look. Look what's on the ground. What's on the ground now? Where was that last time? A deep, what was it last time? I can use it. I'll use it. I hope it won't be doing a lot of melee. Okay. How far is this reach? How far is it? Oh, that's my shield. That's low damage. Okay, there we got one. Correct? Is that, yeah, we got one of those little skulls in the bottom now. 
I should probably use these scrolls just so I know what they are. Bees? Okay. I probably should have explored more. Nah. Another scroll there. Um. This is like unlimited, la unlimited mana. Yeah. Okay. Can you die already? I have five hit points. Um, let's detonate one of these things. How does it work? Must be... Must target a dead pulse with this power. Oh, I see. Can I raise one of these guys? Yeah, there we go. Yeah, easy. Don't kill my friends. Thank you. Okay, can I have a... Um... That's the same one I got. A couple of those things. I'm just going to hang out here for a minute and heal up. I should, maybe, I should make sure I use my, um, my friends a little more. Which is two. Come along, friend. What we got there? What kind of shoes? Flippy floppies? <laughs> All right. We healed up yet? Let's go. Wait a second. Hello. Uh, two. He doesn't last very long, does he? Uh, let's put him out there. No Deadpool. Uh, I need two of those for, the, for that. There we go. Okay. Ooh. Town Guard Shield. Now, what was this stuff a minute ago? Can I use that? Can I use that shield? I can't. Alright. Well, let's go, um, I guess venture on down. I think... I'm not sure I need one of these guys. I can handle this guy. There we go. Okay. Feel better now. Level one's scary. Uh, yeah, I would like something. Uh, give me a, um, give me some good of this stuff. Bolt of Foom, that's good stuff. What is this? Lava Lance. Straight line for three. Contra ice block. Contra five ice block cross of ice. Prevents movement. Or a decoy man. Contra a totally convincing decoy man that will draw enemy attacks away from you. Could be good. Level three, I can get this one. Elemental resistance. And, uh, and, and battle mage. Oh, this is a wizard mage. What am I looking at? This one. There we go. This will give me Mana Bones. Grants defensive aura on dead pulse pickup. Damaging champions and bosses will occasionally spawn dead pulses. Oh, so pick them up gives me a defensive aura, okay? Or we've got Volatile Liquidity. Cause a crystal creature take 10 poison damage each round for 6 rounds. If he dies while then, he explodes. Oh, they, 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 um, they do damage and then reform as a mostly under your control. Hey. I'll take it. Okay, uh, let's pop out this guy. Oh, wait, let's try it. How far does it work? Oh, wait around. Oh, he's quick. What's that question mark? What does that do? Can I talk to him? What is going on? Um, hello. 
Okay, he's gone now. Ooh, fancy boots. Are those any good? I can't wear them. Turn up on my buddy here and uh, blast this guy as he comes in. Okay, now we're getting back on our dead pulses here. There we go. Yeah, if I kill one with that thing, I guess I get a, uh, a mostly. Can I pick up a dirt caster's mini cloak? Is that any good? Uh, it is. It's uh, yeah, yeah, that's nice. Iron beat stick. Two d seven plus four. That's good. That's real good. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna see what this scroll does. Um, where is it? it? Uses a scroll of curse gear. My tunic glows with dark energy. Whoops. <laughs> what good thing I got? Oh, I can't. Uh, I can't. Well, great. With that, with that thing. Uh, elf limp caster, I could use that. Okay, uh, let's see. That is this thing. That's what I need to be using. And then I need. Hey, you wanna you wanna come off? Um, these eyes gaze into the beyond. All roads are revealed. This is a wise eyes of Yan Seer. What's it do for me? Just like to reveal the map. Beastie there. Be oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. All right. Sure. Throwing out there for right now. Okay, let's go down. Forget the gold. All right, we're in dangerous lands. Ooh, what is that? What is that? Fallen champions. Oh, is that where I died? No. I didn't die there. Did I? Who's this guy? Ouch! Um. Ooh! He's mean! He's not so bad. Bob Ross is not very powerful at Dungeon Man's, but even the most junior graduate from the Academy has a force of will stronger than the average man's. Some small essence of Bob Ross's language here. As you approach it, it swirls around you, bestowing what power it can. Thanks, Bob. Right. Um, well, I would like, um, Grave Mooks. Just assume all your dead pulses to build a loyal Grave Mooks who will fight on your side. The number of Grave Mooks is based on the dead pulses consumed. The power of the Grave Mooks scales with your level, but they are generally fragile. How long do they last? Dies again, explodes, deals poison. Yeah, well, let's get that guy. I got a proof of strength. Oh, I did. Nice. See if I can spawn one of these guys and see what he does for me. Uh, let me pop him in here. This guy. Okay. Oh, look at that. How long do you guys last? Yeah, go, go get him. Yeah, I'm a real necromancer now. Oh, yeah. Go get him. Oh, yeah, we got this. Oh, oh, never mind. Never mind. Shield up, be scared. That's that's real necromancer. Good 
Check out that man the damage I'm doing with, with my 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 uh, bolt now. Um good stuff. I'm now in adventurous zones because I leveled up. Twelve damage now. Yeah. Now we're doing some damage. Ooh, some new boots. Please be remove curse. Remove curse. I could, be, I could use one of those. Um, ooh, a better beat stick. No, that's the one I had before, isn't it? Huh. No, it's new. What's the old one I had? That one, I guess? Yeah. But I think I like this thing. This is extra spell power. That's good stuff. Can't use that because it's real armor. Um, let me try this scroll of curse gear. I don't want one of those. No, that's not what I want. Those are bad. Pull these guys out. Shield up. Well done, little guys. What are you? Are you any better? Same thing. Crush like a There he is. Where is he? Where? I don't. There he is. I see him. I see him. I see him. I'm scared. Um. I'm kind of scared. Okay. Keep that on. Don't lose your shield. He's smashing us. I will assist. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, I want to do six, and then I want to do five. No, I need I need a dead pulse. I'm gonna put the uh, the five onto him. Okay. Go get him, Skellies. Can I do this again? Can I do like more? There's already somebody out there. Can I do more of it? Yeah, I can. First true victory over the forces of evil. Congratulations, you are, are in order. Don't get too distracted by the slimy, <laughs> the shiny loots. There are still monsters nearby. Are you bleeding or poisons? Don't let your guard down. I got it. I got it. I got this figured out. Necromancer was the key all along. Proof of strength. Put a couple of those guys out. I need some more of these. Uh, ooh, there's a lot of them. Oh, he's a big guy too, isn't he? Um, I'm gonna hit you with this. Oh, I'll just throw some. Oh, oh, no, oh, I'm not gonna do that. Excuse me, sir. No healing, please. Take that. Uh, another one of you? Get out of here. Watch out, I'm getting confident. Hmm. Thank you. I love that I, whoops, I can um, raise more than just like one thing. A lot of times with necromancers in games, you know, you get like one guy. It's kind of lame. I want armies. I want hordes of undead. Okay, did I ever level myself up? Um, I didn't. Okay. Let's go. I guess we're going to go through the portal. Let's do it. We, we save the day. We're, he we're heroes. Hey, fake. It's clear. Uh, let's go turn this thing back in. And tell them what we did. Uh, I'm gonna give you... I got. Uh, I never got a relic, because I, I lost that before I died. I have to create an entirely new overworld while keeping the academy data safe. No, no, thanks. I'll give you some stuff. For identifying. Uh, ooh, that is nice. 
Super Chill, Prance Elf, Limpcaster, Flame Rot. I'll take that. And, um... I'd like to lose the, uh, the, the bad stuff, please. How do I sell all this junk at? Mm. Yep, we just go sell it all. Uh, where's the blacksmith at? He's over here, isn't he? Okay, go away. Um, here's some trash gear I'd like you to melt down. All of my unlocked non-magical. Hey, that's kind of handy. Here's everything I'm carrying. Put it in the fire. <laughs> uh, <laughs> all of it. Yep, melt it all down. Purchase upgrade hammers. Let me see the, the Academy War Gear Vault. What is that? Vault is for uh, gear that is legendary or set piece quality. Or heroic gear from fallen graduates past. Huh. What you, no blueprints. What do I have now? Identify. No, what did I do that for? That's not what I want to do. But, uh, luckily, it uh, it did not squander it for me. Thanks. As soon as we're getting one point of shield craft. Yes, please. Um, what do I do with the proof of strength? To Academy Headmaster. Hold on to it. Yeah, I thought. Hey, buddy. Relics. Proof of strength. Undeniable mark of prowess and tenacity. Uh, talk to uh, the Battlemaster. Yeah. Okay. New supplies at the Acap uh, Alchemy Lab. Okay. Expand the Alchemy Lab level one. Future graduate graduates can visit the Alchemy Lab and have potions up to tier one pre-identified. Great. Hey, Unknown Planet. How's it going? Uh, talk to who? I don't have any books, I don't think. Okay. Um, I can go ahead. Let's go, um... Not you. Is it you? Let's upgrade our starting weapons and armor. Oh, so when I start, when I die and come back, I can have... Ah, that's, that's cool. Okay. Who am I supposed to talk to here? Ooh, thanks. Ooh, all right, all right. Tropical mystery mix. What do you got? No, uh, the, the Libromancer. Uh, I bring books, yeah. Okay, uh, let's get the spending, this Battlemaster. I would like, um, I think a bit more Foom is what I want. That's to measure my connection with magic. How many of these do I get? Oh, yeah, this is good stuff. Two of these things? Yeah! That's what I want. Thanks, buddy. Uh, why are there video game playthroughs on your Ink channel? Uh, so whenever I did, um, when we, when we had the, the Steam Festival, with, like, loads and loads of, of, uh, demos and things, I had so many videos, um... I want to get them posted, but I just didn't want to overload my main channel, so I put them over there. Um, I don't remember what these these things are. Is there something that tells me? Showdown at Caves Wallow Marsh. Let's go here. This seems difficult. There's a lot of them. So you need to die? A street jit. All right. Ooh. Oh my! They're throwing bombs! Knock it off! Okay, that's uh, the rest of what we need. Let's just uh, get, get out there. They have hearts because they love me. Now they're burning. I want to break the, uh, that. 
Can you stop killing my friends? <laughs> that guy's tough. Uh, how, how much more life you got, buddy? I appreciate you stop, stop chasing me around like that. Um, I need more of those. Yeah, um. Victory upon victory. Heap them high in pilerific monument to the might of dungeon men. For all that trouble, there'd better be some sparkling loots nearby. Okay. Here we go. And I got a, I got a, um, a an artifact. All kinds of stuff. Uh, ooh, look at all the stuff. Ooh, a fancy rod, eh? This is better than what I got. Plague choked. Ignore 11% of incoming damage. I like it. And a new mini cloak. Okay. The cool artifact. Return it to the headmaster. He'll know what to do with it. Some cool gauntlets, which I don't have anything on my hands. And that's it. And still no remove curse. Eat curse. Okay. Never mind. I found it. Um, is that the best thing I've got? That's just normal tunic. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so let's level up here. So I could go and like learn how to hold some things. Advanced crushology. <laughs> this game's fantastic. <laughs> um, what's the the bolt of fooms one? Is that a magic? That's a that's this thing. Can I make it cooler? Wizard staff now attacks all adjacent enemies with every strike. Yeah. Have a lance. Nice block. I don't, maybe we just make our guys cooler. Target creature is, is addled for five rounds. Has beneficial effects stripped away and is cursed to achieve extra pur dread purple damage. Damage. Just picking them up gives me a gives me a defensive war. That could be pretty handy. Um. Yeah, I think that could be pretty handy. It, I'm leaning towards that one, but I think. Uh, staff and sword combo. Uh, you know, I think I'm just, um... What was that? When you take elemental damage, you will gain a dodge bonus on the following round. Quick dash, battle fervor. Uh, no, I'm gonna take... Get some mana bones. Decoy man would be good. Oh, hey, there's more people out here. What are you doing out here? Your friends are dead! That. Okay. Get out of here. We could go back home, but we don't need to go back home. Stop by the town here and see what we can do. Heights of Wenham. Uh, nice to meet you. Um, I could give him some purloin inventory. Yeah. You got, I think I have. I have two of them. Here you go, buddy. Thank you for giving me two crates of pearl and inventory. Our prosperity is now level two. Achieve maximum prosperity for the very first time. I'll never forget you, Untinti. I won't either. Even if you die, but you won't die, right? I'm the best. <laughs> okay. Frank, what you got for sale? Garbage, Frank. Garbage. Uh, that made it might be so bad. What do I? I don't have a. Do I have pants? I don't have any pants. How much for this? A gold? Okay. Do you really not know what it is? Bonus a shield for max health. Well, maybe not the best thing, but... I gotta put something on my body. Oh, can I... Can you buy things? Sell all these excess loots. Um, I'd rather just tell you to... Sell... All my non-magical. You can probably just have everything that I've got. Yeah. All my arms and armor that aren't equipped or locked. I think I don't think I have anything. No arms, armor that I want to keep. Yeah, it's all yours. Just don't take the scrolls. 
There we go. That, why isn't that in more games? That is that is the uh, the best thing we got here. Um, more pants. Bark skin, heartburn, a heartburn potion. Burn with terrible heat, taking constant damage and dealing fire damage with melee attacks. I'm gonna play some Dungeon Mans later today. Dungeon Mans is great. I, uh, I, I, I like it a lot. Um, what do you got? Ooh, that's nice looking. A bone fist cane? How much gold do I have? How much gold do I have? That's, that's nice looking. It's unidentified. Where's my, where's my gold? I have three gold. I don't have... How much was that for? 25? I don't have that. 75 on that one? Is it cursed? I like to have that. How about over here? What's all going on with the with the inn down here? Or the, you know, the, the merchant. What what is this in the inn? Settles it. This bar is officially fancy. Time to break out the good copperware. What can I do for you? I heard any news around town? Monsters that need crushing, gleaming loot piles, harmless and unattended. Word kid did come by as something interesting out yonder, but might be a pretty good haul for someone like you. Assuming the monsters don't get the best of you. Want to hear about it? Do I? Thank you kindly. So I heard someone going on uh, about Yan Sears Monument, very far southwest of here. Just a rumor. Okay, thanks. I'd like a meal, a horn of your frothy stale, and a room for the night. Monsters just crush better after a good night's sleep. <laughs> yeah, that works. Yeah, it's it's very silly. I didn't buy cursed pants, did I? I bought fancy pants. Magical pants. Don't scare me like that. I bought I bought cursed pants. Why did I do that? Why why did I buy per, why did I buy cursed pants? <laughs> Wait a minute. Why did I buy cursed pants? Okay, curse is no longer there. Um All right. He must want to talk. Uh, Victor. Your name's Victor? No. What do you have for sale? Just potions? Eat curse. I might need that. Yeah, I'll take one of those. I have a problem. Okay, uh, let's, let's get out of here. To the overworld. Uh, that's level two. We got another, uh, incursion thing going on over here. Uh, I'm really curious about this, uh, thing over this way. Is it over here? Sorry, Mills. And this is... This is, uh, Villains of, of Bustly Lane. Where was he saying it was? Maybe that four down there? Yeah, Yancer's Monument, that four down there. So let's, let's deal with this. Let's deal with this uh, this nonsense outside town here. These guys are just a bunch of, of jerks. Okay. There we go. Get him, boys! Why can't I break that? Walk in here without getting too much damage. I'm fine. Okay, I'll put another one of these things out. Can I put them like back? Yeah, yeah. Like there. There we go. Wrong button. Oh, he's a big guy. Um, I want to hurt him. What does four do? Oh, my right, right, my shield. Uh, and then... That's the Deadpool thing I can detonate. Okay, okay. It's gonna be difficult without skeletons. I got one. Let's hit him with... Oh, I mean, ain't on any. Okay. 
really want to be here. Um, bees, please. 47 damage. That seemed painful. Uh, how about... Uh, I can blink out if I need to. Let's, uh, let's blink out. Grab that. And I'm gonna, uh, why can't I pick this thing up? Because I blinked onto it. Okay, that gives me a little bit of a boost. Um, I think I'm gonna hit him with this again. He's gonna be dying soon. Ouch. Ouch. Okay. I get to publish, not perish. Uh, shield. And then we're gonna get one of these, um... Wait, a turn. Step in the fire for a second. Out of the fire. And then, uh, this. Go get him. While I heal up. Okay. Ooh, that was a little little scary there for a second. Um, anything else cursed that I want to put on my body? That's what I do around here. A re oh, a hat. That's about time I got a hat. Okay, good. I got two more inventory and a book of of what's it? the book's called? I s what was the book called? Where is it? I saw it. Battle, Bath, and Beyond. Can get one point in light armor. That's what I have, isn't it? Yeah. I'll take that. Okay. Nice. Uh, let's uh, go through. Okay. It's a little scary for, for a second. Alright. Hello, uh, good sir. I mean, I guess I might as well give it to you. Here, have some, have some inventory. There you go. You're now level two, which is maximum prosperity. Excellent. I will sell my junk and maybe buy some more cursed things. What else do I have here? I might as well sell all these things because I don't need them. Uh, I do need them. I want this. I want this identified. I can go back home to identify it. Can you identify it? No. I'm just gonna put them on. And I hope that... So, I... I took... So, I'm wearing a plus two. I don't know what that one is. Hey, operator. How's it going? What do you have over here? So is that, it's not cursed, right? It's cursed? I don't think it is. Uh, what's the difference between cursed and not cursed? What's the symbol looking like? It's kind of greenish flowing and that's so, like it's just magical. We don't know if it's cursed or not. I don't know. Um, any more news, buddy? What do you got? Seven silver, it's expensive. Uh, Bastion of Terror, very far northwest of here. Just a rumor. Can identify that that cloak. It's a practiced one, which is what bonus to shield from max health and parry. Sure, I'll take it. Uh, and then I'm gonna sell. Oh, not to you though. You know, wasn't there a, a one of the? Yeah, you. Some nice boots. Hats. No thanks. So my non-magical stuff. I'm gonna go ahead and sell my magical stuff because I don't need either of these either. So you can have my that. I don't have money for exciting things. I do have a restart uh, artifact I can take back home if I want. But uh, we're on a quest, so let's go finish questing. 
Yeah, I mean, it's all that same sort of, uh, that same, you know, realm. The tome and, and Adam. How do I get through here? How am I supposed to get through here? But I want to go to the place. I have to go all the way around. Um, well, if I'm going to go all the way around, I might as well stop by here. There's that castle that we could, we could also clear out. So tell him how great we are. Relics for the Academy? I think I did. My word, look how, look how historical and significant this rare artifact is. Surely you see the value in such a find. Oh yeah, how much is it worth? One gold? It belongs in a museum. I made the right call. Now all we need to do is a museum to store this in. Close your eyes. You founded the Dungeon Man's Academy Museum. Now all your future graduates will gain monster knowledge for each enemy defeated in battle. Monster knowledge will let you see more detailed information about your enemies in the field. Excellent. Generate a book of true things, a collection of indisputable facts. Return to the Headmaster to ensure all four future graduates share in your wisdom. And then I... I don't think I got a proof of strength, did I? Did I? I did. I did. Um, I can't do that, but I can do one other science for, for, um, what's this one do? Dexterity and finesse, increasing your ability to hit, parry, dodge, and adds damage to ranged attacks. Does that include my, my bolt? Add some elemental resistance rating. Uh, increases the potency of my potion scrolls and duration of your curse. This bleeds and po poison. Maybe. Maybe. I'm going to do this guy, though. A couple in there. Well, I'll be turning into Jupiter Hell now that it has full release. Uh, I might. I'm, yeah, I think I might. I might just do a video uh, for it. Rather than a, a stream. I'm curious what this thing does. I kind of want to drink it. What does it do? Stamina, mana, and health regen. Okay. What's it called? Lesser Academy Revitalizing Punch. Alright. Alright. I figured it was something good, but I wasn't quite sure what was going on. Uh, what is this thing over here? The Oakfells. Um, forget it. We're gonna go and... I wanna go for this quest. This guy, the barkeep, told me all about it, and I'm curious. Rustle in the bushes to the side of the road catches your attention, but only a moment before you realize you've stumbled into an ambush. Oh, yeah, they're all around. All right. Go get them. Uh, let's clear out the right side first. He looks very bloody. down here. Uh, my discount skeletons are getting destroyed. Uh, I think I might be in a bad spot here. Um, uh, uh, <laughs> a little scared. I'll take this one. Avoid those. Oh, no! Oh, no! I don't want to die! Uh... I can't play more skeletons. I'm out, I'm out of skeletons. I, can, I, got, I have to put out... I can only have five of them. And I have no uh, things to, to use them on. Okay, there's one. Um, shield up. Okay, thank you for moving around. I appreciate that. I can put one skeleton out. Or I can do this thing. 12 poison damage each round for 6 rounds. It's going to kill whatever it is. This guy looks pretty nasty. I'd like to kill him. There he goes. Oh, nice!
are you guys doing over there? Is this some sort of archer party? Hit this this guy with the big the big bad. There we go. Where'd you go? Okay. I thought for sure I was dead. I thought for sure. That was it. Have a good one, Balvinar. Do I just need to leave? Yeah. I ain't so scared. That was, uh, that was, uh, easy. Okay. Hey, uh, this town, I should tell these guys, you got bandits outside. Real bad. Uh, I got, like, all kinds of new stuff. I got a, uh, things that I don't care about. And, uh, I'm gonna sell them. I'm gonna sell all my arms and armor that aren't equipped. There you go. How much money do I have now? I've got eight gold. Um, what do you have? Never loses. That's right, Bilbo Baggins. That's right. I don't want any of that garbage. What's happening? What is happening over here? Doom Talker. Tis good to meet you face to face, O Dungeon Mans, and finds you in this random place, Brave Dungeon Mans. Great evil stirs, it is a race. My wares will help you keep up pace, and with gold in my pockets, you will lace, Rich Dungeon Mans. Thanks, Doom Talker, but I have to be in a way walker. <laughs> I have to stalker some monsters. Uh, hey, what you got? Ooh. How much? 12,000 gold? What is this? <laughs> what, what is this? Okay. Okay. I mean, I'll take your money. Combat blinking. That could save my life. It's worth it. It's a gold, though. You know, if I try to kill that guy, he's going to turn into some sort of, like, epic mage and murder me. I'll take your money, though. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Okay, let's go see if there's any news here at the, with, at the barkeep. A gold? Man, you're expensive. Word to come by something interesting out yonder might be a good haul for someone. Ramparts of secrets far southeast of here. Just a rumor. Alright, alright. Man, you're expensive. What about you, ma'am? Uh, you've got a scroll of identify. That could be pretty handy. Alright, I'm out. So we're trying to go to... Man, I could... Number two is where we're trying to go to. Yan Sears Mount Monument. The other thing we found was... Um... I don't know what they were. I just remember Yan Seer. Yeah, it's all I mean. Bastion of Terror, number 14, way over there. That was one of them we found. It's a town, um... Tarpon Highway, that sounds familiar. This is a punk roadblock. Dungeon over there. If I can find my way... Oh, these guys can have up to 5 prosperity. Ooh, what are you? You are the Eternal Rests of Malatus? I'll take a little, a little look. It's dangerous in here. The bones of heroes and villains are all the same, as told in ancient rhymes. Where else could one find such treasure? Or such an adventure? Magical loafers? 
These are way better than my flippy floppies. Alright, I got a couple bones. We'll throw some out. Fight the skeletons with skeletons. What are you doing that for? Thank you. Okay, no problem. Scary music here. I'm a little worried. What is that? Mysterious artifact of antiquity. Nice. Hey, buddy. That's what I want over my, my gravestone. When I die, I want one of those. That's what I want. Just let, you know. <laughs> oh, what's happening? Oh, man, things happen in graveyards all the time. There we go. Who would have imagined? Can't tell who's here. Or who around here? Okay. I have a little bit of a Beetlejuice look to him. Basically, it's gonna make sure that I've got. Uh, uh, souls to uh, to use at all times. What's going on over there? Are you friend or foe? Are you a friend? Yeah, you love me. Ooh, uh, I thought it was a staff. Oh, hey, we got a book find. Uh, like, a, like a cool book. That's your beast. True things volume. Oh, that's the thing we were talking about with that guy. I'm trying to go here. Um, I gotta kill a couple more of these guys. Stop hurting me, please. Uh, here we go. Sidetrack, because I'm getting I'm getting alerts over on my stream that uh, YouTube's not re receiving. Am I losing? Oh no! Uh, my stream might be having a little bit of issues. Give it a, mo give it a moment. Okay, all good. Let me rest here for a minute. Let me know if the stream is, is falling apart. It looks like it's okay, though, now. I'm gonna hold off here for a minute. I think it looks like it's all it's all back to uh, where it's supposed to be, though. What was that? A Blood Ruby Targe. I like to know what that is. Oh, it's a, it's a shield? Hmm. How are we looking now? There we go. Okay. More of these. Um, yeah, let's throw some more out. Alright. Um, uh, where's the way down here? I 
I assume there's gonna be a boss in here somewhere. This is where, where who were named uh, Old Malatus. We'll find him. I need um to be able to carry more of these uh, these skull things. Have I got I got backup. Good now, good. Iron toe kicks. Oh, hey, those are, um, defeats armor, defeats block, and parry. There's a kilt, which is good. I'll take that. And some shoes, which are better than these magical loafers I've got, but I can't use them because I can't do medium armor. Kelthazad. You guys just don't know when to give up. Form of evil. Uh, there's a scroll. We don't know what it does. Oh, there's the way down. All right. Fancy door spike. I think there's a button for like. Explore. I don't remember what it is. Like you know, I Adam Adam has that, and I think Tome has it as well. I don't remember what it, what it is though. Auto explore. I mean. Fancy boots. Game says uh, it's getting more difficult. Pay attention. Let's wait. Let's rest here for a minute. Get some help. And, and uh, I think we just head downstairs. We've got everything covered here, mostly. There's the, the top left corner we didn't do, but eh, there's nothing over there. Everyone knows that monsters don't hang out in the top left corner of the map. Out of here. The overconfidence level is through the roof. Where's those stairs? There they are. Okay, okay down we go. Still says dangerous, but I ain't so scared. Oh, so you're tough, huh? Let's see. Is that a, uh, a ring? Well, I'll wear a ring, I think. Um, was that? Burly, Burly Liam? Where's my, uh, my, 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 uh, identify. Let's identify that ring. What's it do? A fencer's ring of foom. Hey, hey, that might be good. Fencer's ring of foom, which is plus two foom. Oh, that's good stuff. Does it matter which hand I put it on? Put it on my right hand. I don't see it on my sheet over here, though. Oh, there it is. Nice. Potion. All right. Oh, 
Oh, hello. I can see you there. Pool in front of you swirls with water laced with a mysterious magic. Who knows how long it's been here? Well, let's drink from it. Uh, massive amounts of extra damage from all magic. Well, maybe we should sort of wait that out. <laughs> okay. There we go. Yeah, I'll, uh, I'll shield up here and say hello to this guy. Take his little scroll there and take another drink. Sure. What happened? Uh, a filthy mostly was waiting at the bottom of the pool, waiting for a friendship. Hey, buddy. Ooh, what are you? You look. You're scary, right? You're a bad dude. Die already? Oh no. Um, more please. Let me go get some more of these dead pulses. And that was nasty. We got a proof of strength for that. And. What is it? What is it? Where is it? A bone fist cane. Now that's my kind of thing. Oh, yeah. There we go. Now I feel like a bit of a hero. All right. All right. Ouch. Oh, ow. I wasn't watching. Man. Okay. Okay. I can't explode green skin. Oh yeah, I can't explode green green things. I can. You're right. Uh, I think I need them more than I can explode them though. I have a friend over there in the other room there. Uh, what can we level up here? Um, grants a fits of aura when death pulses are spent. I think any amount of death pulses charges you with dark energy, amplifying the damage of any attacks you make in the next round by twenty percent. That's good stuff. Or we can addle somebody for five rounds. I'm gonna go with that. That's pretty good. World map is, is randomized, yeah. Another targe. Who's over here? Nothing, just some hearts? That's weird. Big guy. Big guy. Um, I almost think maybe it'd been a better idea. What was that? Something just cursed me. I almost think... Oh, no. I'm death charged. I almost think that it'd been better to do... Actually, I'm going to. Please don't hurt me. We have the undead Frosty Bones and Duke Bastard the Sundered. Me, I'm just leaving. Oh, he died. Okay. Ow. I thought he died. He didn't die. Please die. Okay. Uh, I can use. Oh, I got another one of these rings. Uh, where's that drink I got? Healing potion. Cure embarrassingly small wounds. I'll do this one. Ouch. Okay. Feeling good. Uh, I don't know how damaged this guy is. I can throw the thing, the nasty on him. I'm gonna... I hope that he dies. Why aren't you dying? Please die. 
Do I have bees? I need bees. Scrolls, I don't know what to do. Um, I need some bees. Armor potion. Could do me some good. Stamina, beckon, bolster, weapon, curse, gear, eat, curse. Some of these things, which you don't, we don't know what to do, and that seems like a scary time to be using them. So, I'm gonna move. One. Got it. Hit him with the nasty. I don't want those. Those guys are bad news. Okay, okay, okay. Shoot up right now. I don't have any stamina. Um. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> okay, feeling good. Feeling good. The stream started started to choke a little bit there. It knew bad things were happening. It was trying to save me. Thank you for trying to save me from the embarrassment. Dying. Spike the door and hold it shut. Prevent monsters from opening it and forcing them to try to break it. Oh. That's what those do. That's five gold. Another scroll there. I got a mysterious egg. Return to the Academy Master. He'll know what to do. Alright. Um, feeling good. Feeling good. I want to identify that, but I can't. So, uh... Too close. No, it's gone. I got three of those things left, so I can wait here for a minute. Let's do that, and then wait here for a minute. Heal up. And uh, then we'll go back down there. Okay, so I think we found where it's dangerous. Those big guys. Where have we not gone? Oh, we're right. There's a lot of places to go here. There's a bookshelf there, though, where he was. Propping up the other books is a leather bound journal. This one, I guess? Yeah. Mana potion. And let's drink. Uh, I burn with poison. Ooh. Ooh. I almost killed myself there. Okay. Okay. Almost killed myself by just holding the number down. Yeah, I haven't seen. Yeah, where's the pet system? Is that that's what the egg? Is that what it is? I forgot about. It. I completely forgot about. It. That's the whole reason I, I started playing the game was for that. Uh, my, my my hat's quite nice. Um, is that what that is? If so, we got to get back home and and check it out. Turn to the uh, the academy master. It vibrates with power, a portent of future adventures to come. I gotta go back. Is that what it is? Yeah, yeah. It's, I, it's gotta be. Where do we come in? Leave me alone, zombies. Got business. Hanging out. You guys should be able to just walk off the map, I think. 
Yeah. Okay, so now we have to go all the way back to the academy for this. Is there an easy way to teleport back to the academy? Why is it? It's going to be a long walk. I'm up for it. Wasn't that long of a walk. It's like in Dungeons and Dragons when you're like, man, I don't want to walk. If we get, we're going to have to like walk for three days. Uh, and, and you know, 10 seconds and you're there. Okay. Um, I have some relics. Okay. We'll identify that. And the beasts, right? Proof of strength. Mysterious egg. What mysterious egg this is? There's magic here, that's for sure, and I know just who to call upon this to help this out. Professor Hatch. Ovamancer. He's joined the Academy facility. Faculty. Find him to the right of the Battle Master. Learn about the magic of eggs and battle poultry. Okay. Hey, buddy. Greetings and salutations. My name is Professor Hatch. Uh, I would like to explain the details. Yes, please. Of Ovomancy. Egg magic. What we do here is raise battle poultry, spirited feathery comrades to fight at your side in battle. They grow alongside you and you feed them the delicious monster steaks that show up when they're around. You can guide them down paths of toughness or swiftness. Decide if they fight in melee or range. A pet system, finally. The delicious monster steaks have an additional benefit. As your pet eats them, he may learn the special abilities of the monsters that the steaks were sourced from. And they gain innate abilities as they move closer to maximum toughness or swiftness. How do I know what powers I'll gain? Trial and error, the very best way to raise any young creature. Fortunately, if you find your pet learning tricks that, you don't, that suit you, it's possible to have your pet forget them, allowing you to truly customize each bird to your liking. Can I have multiple birds? You can only have one pet active at a time, but you may carry as many eggs as you like. Change your active pet, just equip a different egg, and blow your battle bird whistle. Call it an action. Should your pet fall in a battle, it's not lost. All is not lost. They will immediately retreat to their egg, but they are now wounded. Must be brought to me for, for healing. What if I fail? Which I will not, till I totally got this. Of course, you're going to live forever, but if you don't, your eggs will be kept safe here at the ranch. Take heed, your pets always match your level. Their tough, swift melee and range scores remain at the same. I mean, same, but the low-level dungeon mans won't be running around with a high-level pet. I'm not going to die, so that's not information I don't need. Uh, that's the basics. Okay, let's do it. It appears you do not have a battle bird whistle. You'll need one to take, these, take commands. I'll toss one carelessly on the ground for you. Go ahead and pick it up. Okay. Now what? Yeah, let's do it. Alright, take a look at this mysterious egg you dropped off earlier. Pick up the egg and equip it. Use your battle bird whistle. Give your new pal a name or prepare for adventure. Your battle poultry enters the world for the first time. Care to give it a name? Beaker? Um, his name is Bird Ross. Okay. Let's breed a pair of poultry to see what happens. I'm afraid you'll need some passionate poultry poultice to make that happen. Okay. Specialty bird item shop. I do trade in specialty items that can help you with birds. Take your unhatched battle poultry and trade for some items. Sell me your unwanted monster steaks and earn battle earned burger points. Okay. Okay, I'm done now. Onward, chicken. Okay. Alright, well, okay. I don't know what else to say. Let's go see if we can... Let's see how the chicken works with this. Alright, chicken. First we spawn things, and then we just kill things. That's how it works, chicken. I pick up, uh, souls and things. You know, you can go in there and fight if you want, chicken. Can I do anything with this? Users to summon battle poultry from your equipped egg. It's already active. It will open the pet menu. Oh. Use all your primal fury. Jump to me right now. Go to this target. Open bird character sheet. Oh, okay. 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 Um, pet the bird. He's me next to me. That makes sense. Right. 
Now, we pet the bird. <laughs> okay, that was worth it. Uh, ooh, that's big. I didn't pay any attention to that. I'm going to put a big thing on him, and then I'm going to uh, shield up, and then I'm going to do this, and back up. There we go. Chalk up another one for the mighty order of dungeon men's. Scoop up the loot! Think about how you'll brag about it to all your friends and don't get killed by whatever trash is left in the room. Okay. Well done, bird. You didn't do anything. Now, did you eat anything? Whistle, I didn't see any steaks drop. Does he have to does he have to do I should have had myself identified. Um I'm just gonna put this thing on and hope it hope for the best. Do we know what it does? No. Oh, mystery. Good job, chicken. He's still my level though, right? That was a uh, basically a boss, yeah. I've got non magical you can have. Um and I think you can have pretty much anything else. I don't need that for anything. I don't need that. Yeah, you can, it's all it's all yours. Well look will it will it be worth more if I know what it is? It says this is worth twenty two gold. Are you gonna sell buy this for twenty gold? No, you won't. If I were to go to like you know that's how much it costs to buy. I could loot this I could let's build this town up town up. There you go. Max prosperity. Okay, I'm the best. Uh, and then now we should sell some things. It's 22 gold. Sell for 1 gold. Okay, so I guess buy for 22. Alright, alright. Uh, yeah, I'll just sell all the stuff I don't want. Okay, 4 gold. I'm at th 32 bucks. Uh, hey, you have anything cool? No. Alright. Oh, I could just use an identify potion. That's really all I care about. Maybe it didn't um the uh the the bar yeah you identify one of those please and there's a location of all stairs in this area in this area like oh yeah and wherever okay I see consume this book and gain one point in skirmish archer eh. one point in dungeon dervish advanced delving I'll, I'll take that one. Oh, that's expensive. Alright, let's see what this guy's got. Seven silver, that's cheap. Temple of Darkness, very far southwest of here. Okay. Um, I'll, I'll, I'll take a nap, you know? Fifteen silver, I'm not sure what that does for me. Tinti and his army of skeletons led by his second in command, the chicken. Oh. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> what's happening? I don't know what's happening. But it's fantastic. <laughs> Trivial, it says. Oh, there's my stairs right there.
Oh, hey, we got a steak. Two skeletons get in there and handle that. Uh, yeah, let's just keep on. Let's just, just get down here. You want some more skeletons? More skeletons. Stop standing in the fire! Bees! Should probably keep an eye on my hit points. I'm not feeling too good. Ooh, another egg. Is that, is that another egg I found? I think it was. Unhatched battle poultry. Ah, okay, okay. We can go sell it for something in some school. Here's what spawned this, or if it's a random thing, or if it's uh, because the chicken's out, it spawns it. But yeah, it's clearly, yeah, net hack. Or rogue. Or any, any old timey roguelike. A lot of things in here. I'm glad it's easy level. Let's keep going. Level four. Get him, chicken. Um, my, my skeleton, they can handle it over there. I have to figure out we're going to feed the chicken here. Can I feed him now? Um, I've got a riot girl steak. Increase melee by one. This steak may teach your pet's punk squawk song. Um, we've got, we've got, uh, where's the other one at? I do we have more than that. This one's increased melee by one. Teach your pet venom beak. That sounds like a thing to have. Yeah, uh, here you go, buddy. Eat up, little bird. Um, here, do it again. Just chow down, buddy. Uh, he gained a new power. Venom Beak may sharp... Mighty sharp peck effect may cause the victim to take additional poison damage over time. Good job, Bird Ross. <laughs> and then we've got, um... Riot Girl did what? I may learn the Punk Squawk song. Yep. There you go. Good job, buddy. Uh, increases your damage dealt by 10% by singing. Yeah, I almost left that artifact right there. So much loot. Ouch! Saw some meat fall over there.
That guy's kind of nasty, and I don't feel too good. But he's dead. I'll be here for a minute. Heal up. Oh, yeah, he has a more majestic sprite. <laughs> what food did I get? Uh, a, a pangolin steak. May teach him ragdoll toss. I know what that is. No. Uh, rest here for a minute, a little longer. Took a long time to heal. Bees! Hey, chicken. Let's go this way. Ooh, lots of things in there. What's oh, he's doing his squawk. Oh, they're destroying him. I'm trying to think maybe I'm not even needed around here. Another artifact for us. Oh, oh, sorry. I didn't see you, buddy. My chicken saw you, though. Uh, hey, you want a bandit steak? A mysterious ring, huh? Uh, let's identify that. I've got, uh, identify. I've got one on my body. I wish I identify that one. Um, where is it? Identify. Um, this isn't because it's something different. It's mysterious, also. What's it do? It's a berserker band, which does what? Doesn't sound like what I want. Uh, more melee damage. Take more damage. Knock back and stun resist. No, I don't want this. This is garbage. Uh, here, you want... Um, I'm just going to give him all the all the, the melee stakes. Let's see why not. That's all I got. Check my pit menu again. Um, how do I do that? With my... With my uh, this guy... Uh, oh yeah, so he's all melee. Um, still haven't figured out toughness or whatever. So this is a mighty sharp peck. Does damage. Enemies are near you. Peck cries with a, a, a punk song, which does more damage. I guess I can have four total. Tough birds take lots of hits and call attention to themselves. Swift birds move around the dungeon quickly and dodge often. Melee and range determine what type of attacks the bird uses. As they eat steaks, they can learn special powers based on the creatures they snacked on. Okay. Yeah, uh, good, good chicken. I think I think they are all chickens. What kind of clothes was that? A silken foom vest. Yeah, that's good. Can I find a way down yet? No, we got doors up, up, up here. Where's that go? That's that where we came from? Yeah. Ouch. What is that? An ornate captain's buckler. All right. I need to rest up here a little bit. I think I'm just gonna hit a healing potion. I could just sit here, but uh, I think I have. Yeah, I got plenty of them. They're really good for combat. Those are super overpowered. That was just a minor one. Uh, magical loafers and a beckon monster scroll. 
would be probably pretty handy if I was a melee guy. Or one of those, like, the melee mages that uh, you can build. I have seven hit points. I'm gonna die in here and just, because I'm just running through it too fast. Okay. Ooh. It's a pretty nasty chicken. Stop that. Oh. Man kills you by making you feel like you played Diablo. Yeah, yeah. That I just picked up. Uh, oh, a door spike. Okay, grab these. Hey, there's a the stairs finally. Okay, we ready? Let's rest for a second. Dreams of distant dungeons. Distant dungeons. Level five. She called me a wanker? Is that what she's saying? <laughs> yeah. well, how long is this going to last? Does this go until we die? We're still in just adventurous mode. Um... Hmm. Not that way. Where'd you come from? I don't like you. All right, what you doing behind that chest there? Ooh, ooh a new, a new cane. That's what I've got. Dungeon crowbar. Um, this guy. Just the same as what I have. Um, I thought mine was, mine was magical. Is it not? I thought for sure mine was magical. Hmm. Right, I would. I thought for sure mine was magical. I want to teleport back. I'm, I'm, ooh. Ouch, 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 ouch. Maybe I will teleport back. Get behind my chicken here. Ten hit points. Uh, let me hit that. Um, I, mean, I, I can just sit here and rest. Probably the best thing to do. Hey, Grover. Just takes a long time to heal. I wonder if I need more strength would help that out. Seems like a safe place. Well, we've gone to it was it was trivial. Now we're at adventurous mode for how the dungeon levels. So I think maybe I'm not sure. Maybe this is either either never ending or or it's ending. It's one or the other. I, I gathered that through my use of playing games. Get him, chicken. Just blew those guys up. Look at these robes I've been finding. I got, um... Yeah, I do have this, which we don't know what it is. 
Oh. No, it's so good. Yeah, we're, I think we're, we're good. We got all the good stuff on. Heal up here for a minute. Oh, yeah, hunger. Hunger's the worst. Uh, Adam and, and Tome both have a hunger, a hunger meter. Yeah, door spikes. That would be a good heal, wouldn't it? Um, let's go. Let's go down here. Wait. Hmm. It looks kind of scary. Yeah. I know I'm gonna get myself killed by trying to just wait and, uh, Oh, hey, here you go, buddy. Okay. By trying to heal myself by waiting. I don't want to squander them all, though. Liquid bandage. Cancels ability effects. I don't have a lot of heals. I probably should just sit there. I got all these scrolls. I don't know what they do. Could be some good stuff. If I was healed, I'd, I'd, I'd try them out. Let me go... Um, What? What killed me? What? No! No! Oh, man. But I don't want... I was only level 5. Killer was myself. I killed myself. How did I kill myself? 4 damage from the kill. I, uh... Bird Ross lashes out with a poisonous barbed tail. He dies. Untinti takes 4 damage from the kill. What? What? You died with one blink or fast movement item in your backpack? Could you have moved to safety? No. You died with 41% of your stamina. Poor, y'all. Yeah. the end, you took 42 health and damage over 10 turns. Eight recovery items. Did you try using any of them? No. Take heart. Your next hero has five proofs of strength waiting to bolster their monster crushing power. Possibly my new staff. I don't, I don't know. Oh, maybe. Maybe my staff. Yeah. That could be it. <laughs> anyway, so if I start a, game, a new game... Let's just check this out real quick. Um, we'll, we'll be Jimmy here. Jimmy can be a, um, uh, a tourist man. Um, Southern-born tourist man. There we go. There's Jimmy. Okay, now I'm curious, but what if do we begin with a, uh, a a pet? I don't think so. Okay, um, what do you mean special training? Before you brought, uh, doesn't mean before you have brought academy artifacts back here and have put them to good use. As the campus grows, so does the knowledge you can provide for the newest recruits. Normally, Dungeon Man sets forth a basic training in the bare essentials with the mysteries of arcane potions. Uh, I can visit the faculty to get a leg up on skills and item identification. Great. Um, I kind of can, but I, um, I guess if I went back, let me see here if I talk about this guy. Um, oh, I do, I have five of these to begin with to start. Okay, okay. And then, oh yeah, it's fine. And then you over here, there's a chicken there. 
No, get, just get to work. Okay, there's my whistle. Is that, um... Oh, it's Bird Ross. You don't follow me though, right? No, you're not, you're not my Bird Ross. Hmm. You're just there to remember Bird Ross. What is Pluck? Which one of Pluck increases a bird's maximum health by 1%. Feeding my birds rare steaks they get. Okay. What does the generation of a bird matter? Every genera every level generation past the first increases your bird's overall damage by 10. Okay. Okay. Um, thanks. So we'll look at my statue here, and then, and then we're gonna... Hey, call it a day. It's a good place to, uh, to end the stream, I suppose. Third time's a charm. Let me in. I'm gonna go look at my statue. There he is, slain in deep in the fifth floor of dreams at distant dungeon's distance. Yeah. Alright. Oh. We have new things over here. This is Sir Dugarin Othaxen. This is the Academy Museum. This is the Monster Knowledge. What happened to the monster? Not the items I turned in. We have a rare collection. Um. Okay. I think I think I don't have it because um, my uh, my 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 loot that I had is is on my body, my dead guy's body. Yeah, like a boss. Um, oh, is that when you re-cleared re again? I died up... Well, wasn't I here? In this town? Um, this isn't going to go well. <laughs> I just wanted to go to town. I just wanted to, just wanted to go into town. I didn't realize there was a ambush going on outside. Alright, anyway. Anyway, I was, hoping I, go, I was hoping I could go to the town and then pick up my body. Uh, no, no, I don't care about that. Alright, there's Dungeon Man's. Uh, it's a fantastic little roguelike. Maybe not so little. Fantastic roguelike. Traditional one. Um, good stuff. Yeah. Proper roguelike. So, anyway. Uh, it's 15 bucks. You can find it on sale. I think it goes on sale every once in a while. I don't know. Um, I think I picked it up on sale, but I, I don't remember. Um, anyway, thanks for watching, everybody. Um, we're going to call it a day. Uh, we'll be, uh, hopefully, there'll be a, a Dungeons & Dragons live stream on Friday, and then Saturday will be something else. Um, if you die in the dungeon, the monster that kills you becomes the dungeon master, by the way, so you can revenge on them. Oh, good, good luck. oh okay. Okay. I remember it said something about that. I didn't know what it was talking about, but I, I get it. Uh, all right. Thanks for watching, everybody. And uh, we're going to call it a day here. So um, everybody have a good one. We'll, uh, those of you on Twitch, we'll, we'll go raid someone playing some Dwarf Fortress. All right. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.